We thought we'd do a quick video on the Uniblade seal. Primarily how the parts click together and what parts you need to use for what situation you've got. So when you open the Uniblade pack, you'll get three parts of seal and you'll get your instructions. Now your instructions will detail exactly what you need to do for what situation, but some people prefer a visual, which is fine. In the pack, you'll get three pieces of seal. Now you're only ever gonna use two pieces. So the pieces that you don't use, which you'll learn after you've watched this video, you can just uh, recycle in your plastics. So in both situations, you're always gonna use the small piece, which is this, what we call the L-shaped piece. Now, this piece here is hard plastic, and the shorter edge of this is the part that clicks into the other seal. Uh, we've had a few people try to click the longer part in, but it's always the shorter part of this seal. So if you've got a bath screen, which is a screen over a bath, you're gonna use, in conjunction with the, heart, the smaller part, this part here, which is what we call um, the bath screen part of the seal. So this has got two soft rubber blades coming off the bottom. It's more of an, a longer seal than the other one. So this is how you'll determine which one this is. And you'll see these two little uh, plastic parts here at the bottom of the uh, hard plastic, and that is the receptor channel. So all you need to do to create this seal is to click the shorter part of the smaller seal into that receptor channel, like this. And you just push it together with your thumb, nice and easily, and that will click together all the way through the seal. And then what that creates is your U channel there at the top, which is the piece that pushes onto the glass, and your soft rubber fins at the bottom, which create the seal between the glass and the flat bath edge. You will need to trim these down in some situations, which is shown in the longer video. The link will be in the description of this video. Shower enclosures where the glass door opens outwards. Sometimes you'll have a seal at the bottom that pushes onto the glass that will seal down to a flat surface like a shower tray. Um, if that's the situation, then you would just use the seal that we've just shown you for that situation also, as it will work exactly the same way as a shower screen on a bath or a bath screen. The one thing we forgot to mention was that on the bath screen, shower screen situation, this part of the seal, this soft rubber part here, this little flap here, this needs to be positioned on the inside of the screen. So any water running down the glass will deflect away from the bottom. This is sort of a, another type of seal uh, It helps the water stay in the enclosure. So if you've got a shower door that has a metal frame under the glass, so the door passes over a metal frame or a threshold, and you don't necessarily need to seal down to that threshold, what you need to do is have what we call a deflector or a drip ledge, pushing the water away from the gap between the glass and that metal frame. So this is what the other two pieces of the Uniblade are designed to do. So with this, you again use the hard plastic L-shaped piece, and we're again, we're pushing the shorter part of that into the receptor and with the other part of the seal it is distinctively different you can see it's more of a, a sort of an L shaped itself the soft rubber blades are coming off at an angle to the hard plastic upstand so again we just find the receptor part of this uh, this shower door seal and we push the hard plastic L shape into it and we just do the same again it click, it'll click together and then what that does and you do that all the way through the seal what that does it gives you that nice new channel again and that will push on to glass and then you've got these two soft fins that come off at a 90 degree angle and that will deflect the water as it comes down the glass away from the, the gap between the glass and the metal frame underneath. The last thing really we need to say about this is the Uniblade will fit onto glass from 3mm to 8mm thick and that is straight or curved and that is because it is super flexible as you can tell it's probably the most flexible seal on the market. So hopefully this short video has answered any uh, questions you've got. If you have any more questions, please drop us a line and the longer video detail will be put in the link in the description.